Yo, what is going down YouTube? It's A. Jones coming out with another video and I know it's been a while since I've been back but I've been really really busy with school. It's starting to get really hard. Um, if you guys want to see a lot more of me, which I don't know why you would want to, um, <laughs> go check out my other channel, A. Jones Fitness. I'm going to try to start posting more and more videos on that uh, channel just because that's truly like my passion. I really enjoy doing that stuff. Um, so I'm going to try to release weekly videos on that and try to boost that channel up. Um, so thank you for going to check that out and today I'm going to be talking about betting systems, betting schemes. I like to bet money. Um, if you guys don't know that, I like to bet college football, college basketball. Um, I realized lately I'm not good at betting at MLB so I don't do that. I like to bet pro football, really not that good at that either. Okay, I'd say I'm okay at it but definitely college basketball and college football are my strong suits I'd say. Um, so I like to bet my dad. He usually takes the bets I, uh, I give him. Always with the line. Oh, I always bet like Denver plus nine and a half or Denver minus nine and a half. So always with the line. I never do the uh, the over under. I never I never do that just because uh, a game can go either way. So it could be like I look at how the teams match up and how what the um, general score is going to be, but not like the total score. I look at how oh yeah Denver is going to win by seven points. I look at that more than. Oh, I think it's going to be 50 to 43. So I look at the um, the difference between the two scores. It's just easier for me. My brain comprehends that a lot easier. Honestly, I, I, I don't want to be too cocky or anything, but I definitely say I'm above average at betting. Definitely not a pro, not, not an expert, but that'd be awesome if I could be. And that's why I started looking up betting schemes, which I have a note card here that talks about all the research I've done on um, systems. First off, I, I don't even know why I didn't even look these up in the first place because in the past like six months, I've been, uh, man, there's got to be a way. There's there's, there's just got to be a way that you change the, the amount of money you bet to maximize your profits. And I thought about that. I'm like, man, that is genius. What, what can I do? Maybe I could double my money every time I went or increase it by $50 every time I went. Or, oh, maybe I should scale down when I lose. Maybe I should bet more when I lose. I, I just didn't know. First off, there's billions of people in this world. I'm sure somebody posted it online. And I didn't realize that until like a week ago. So I just started looking up betting schemes. And these are the ones I have. So um, a negative progressive uh, system is something where you're losing. And you try to like progressively get your money back. And positive progressive is the opposite where you're winning money and you want to win more and more of that money. So the only negative progressive scheme, or actually one of the negative progressive schemes is the Martingale system, which is genius but kind of dumb at the same time. It's um, double your the amount you bet every time you lose. So say you bet $5 and you lose, you're going to bet $10 the next time. And then say you bet you lose that, you bet $20 the next time, and then $40, um, and then $80, and then $160. The reason you do this is because you it's easier to get your money. It's You get your money back after one win. And I think you get even more. So it's like, say you lose the 5 you lose the 10 and then you bet 20 you get $5 back. And now that's a genius way. Now if you're not going to lose... Usually in betting, it's so it's 50-50 odds in betting sports. Um, you're not going to lose like more than four in a row if you have decent talent in at, at analyzing teams and analyzing analyzing scores. So I thought that was kind of genius. I'm going to use that, but uh, definitely don't use that at casinos because they have a table limit and once you hit that table limit, you're out and it's not going to take much to keep on doubling your money. Don't do that at casinos. Um, do that to bet games do that to bet um bet for fun like with a buddy or something um another one is progressive two i think it's called i don't know it's a progressive scheme so essentially if you have two numbers say you pick five dollars and fifteen dollars um after every time you lose you bet five dollars after every time you win bet 15 so you you uh bet five dollars to start you win so you bet 15 you win again you bet 15 you win again you bet 15 you win again you bet 15 then you lose so you bet five and you just keep going back and forth and back and forth. Um, that's a two progressive, uh, progressive five, which is one, two, three, five, one. So after a loss, you go to one. So say you bet five dollars, you win. Then you go to ten dollars. You bet, t uh, you win. You bet fifteen dollars. Then you win. You bet uh, it would be five times five, so you bet twenty-five dollars. And then you go back to one. So then you just keep on doing this cycle. And uh, it's genius. So all these will be in the description below. I know it's kind of confusing for me to read it out to you guys. Um, but after every loss, you go to one. So say you win. Um, first off, one, two, three, five, one. It's 
imagine one X, two X, three X, five X, and one X, and X is your first amount you're gonna bet. So then your second one would be two times that, your third one's three times that, your fourth bet was five X, so it's five times that, and then you go back to your original. So you bet five dollars, you win, you bet 10, you win, you, uh, you bet 15, cause three X, so, and then you lose then you go back to one. And now with all these betting schemes, um, it's really weird how it works, because if you did flat betting, um, they've done math on these. On certain scenarios, sometimes you're gonna come up more if you do flat betting, and then if you do flat betting, you're gonna come out to zero, say that's a scenario. If you, sometimes, in some situations, you'd come out on top if you do the progressive schemes or all these other systems. And then say that it's the same for losing. You're losing on the flat betting. You're gonna be less. You're gonna be more ahead, but still behind if you do these progressive schemes. I'm not sure what the whole math ratio is, but it, it's different for every scenario. Um, another one is Hot Street Blackjack, which is reduce X after each loss, increase X after each win. So um, say you bet twenty dollars, and then you increase five dollars every time you win, and you decrease five dollars every time you lose. So. Twenty dollars, you win. Twenty-five, you win. Thirty, you win. Thirty-five, you win. Forty, you lose. So, so let's say you go from twenty. So you went to twenty, twenty-five, thirty, you lose. So then you go back to twenty-five, and same thing over and over and over. A, a good one I thought was bet a fourth of what you have. So then, whenever you win more, you're betting more, and whenever you lose more, you're betting less. So um, you have a hundred dollars. You bet twenty-five. You win, then you bet a fourth of 125, and then you win that, and you bet a fourth of whatever that you're, whatever you're, the money you have. Now, say you bet, you have $100, you bet $25, and now you have $75. Now you bet a fourth of 75, which is going to be less than 25. So now you're betting less if you're on a losing streak, and you're betting more if you're on a winning streak. Now, that is definitely going to help with your streaks. Another one is add 50% to your bet. So, um, Say you win $100, uh, bet $150. Say you win $150, you bet 1.5 times 150. I don't know what this is if you lose. So if you have $100 and you lose, then you start over. No, I, I really don't know. I think I, I think I wrote that one only if you're on a winning streak. These are all the betting systems that I've looked up and they seemed kind of smart. They seemed kind of legit. Just be careful with the martingale system because that is really easy to double and lose your money. It's like every time you double $5, it it's going to increase very quickly. Give me a feedback on this video, please. If you guys have your own system, let me know in the comment section below. Um, you can connect with me on Twitter at ajizzyfoshizzy. Um, it's in the description below. Um, I'm going to develop a system that is 85% guaranteed to work. I'm, I'm going to work on it. I'm going to try to devise like this plan where it's... Uh, where, where it's going to be more successful, your success rate and your profits are going to be maximized, um, hopefully. I mean, I looked online, every site that I went to for these systems said there is not one system that is going to work. Don't buy those books, don't buy this, I'd give you $30,000 if you can find a way to do it. I'm going to look at one and hopefully uh, the way that I bet, I can come up with a system that works for me. I don't know, I thought this was kind of a different video than what all my other videos are. Um, I know it's still making money involved with money, involved with all that. And I have a few more video ideas for uh, th for this channel, but I'm, I'm mainly going to focus on my other A. Jones Fitness channel. So if you want to go see more of my face, which I, I, don't, I don't even want to see more of my face, um, go check out A. Jones Fitness. I truly appreciate it. I would love if you guys subscribe to that channel because that... Just please support me. That would, ma that would mean the world to me if you guys just hit the subscribe button. Um, and thank you. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for making it all the way to the end of this video. If you guys have and you guys watch all my other videos, I love you. I, I really do. I, it's awesome. I, I appreciate all the numbers running up on the page, the ratings, the likes. I enjoy, I enjoy the numbers on my page. I just, yeah, I, I enjoy it. So thank you guys. The, the camera cut me off in an uh, important deep moment. But thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for your support. I truly, truly appreciate it. Um, and peace out. Uh, hopefully I can post more videos on this channel. I know I, I'm going to focus on the other channel, but I will keep coming back to this channel. So thank you guys for subscribing, and thank you guys for liking. Um, peace. Peace out. Have a good day. And smile more. Smile more. I know that's a Roman Atwood thing, but it's just something that's so, like, I don't know. It's so simple that it's so, it's so awesome at the same time. So smile more. Be happy, spread the happy spirit, and uh, have a good one. Thank you. Peace out. I love you. Ah.